Hey guys, Joe Simpson here, TechWake TV. I wanted to talk about something today. I just picked up this new product and I think you guys might be interested in seeing it. Hang on one sec. It's called the Sonos Move. Upon first inspection, I didn't think this was that big of a deal. But afterwards, and after unboxing it and setting it up, I realized that it's kind of a big deal because they're crossing a barrier here that Sonos has never crossed before. Typically, the Sonos system works on a Wi-Fi system only, and this system now has expanded to Bluetooth. And the reason they did that was because now this speaker is no longer just tied to the wall with a plug. It is portable and it is rechargeable. So Sonos has come out with a speaker. I think it's more or less a Sonos One. It sounds a little bit better than a One, in my opinion. Maybe I'm biased or maybe my ears are lying to me. But this product is pretty cool. It's a rechargeable battery. It's built into the unit. It has a little charging ring that it sits on. When it's on the ring on a platform or a table, it is very, very stable. Uh, it's a little weighty, a little heft. It has everything that Sonos Systems had before, which is the network system, the volume controls. It has Alexa integration. So it has all the good bells and whistles that you love about Sonos, but they've added the ability to take this thing portable, which I've been waiting forever for one of these, because how many times do you want to walk out on the deck, barbecue, drink a beer, just sit out in the good weather and listen to music, and it's a pain to unplug your unit, walk out there, plug it back in, wait for it to reinitialize, this takes all the work out of it. You pick it up, you walk outside with it, and you can listen to it. And if your friend comes over and says, hey, I want to play a song, and he's not on a Sonos system, and there's simply a button on the back that you push that switches it from Wi-Fi to Bluetooth, and now anybody can link up to the unit and play music through that. TruePlay now has gone from something that you have to set up by yourself to what they call auto TruePlay, and it uses a series of microphones on top of the speaker unit and it kind of listens to reflections and sound waves off the walls and kind of auto-tunes itself to the environment that it's in. So you could be listening to it in the dining room one second and then move to another room another minute and it will readjust on the fly as you move around. So you don't have to set it up with your iPhone like you used to with some of the other units. So it's an A-plus product. I think it's as good as any Sonos that's out there. Time will tell whether the battery holds its charge. Um, I don't know the length of time the batteries are supposed to last. I think it's like eight or 10 hours. Uh, on a charge, which would be adequate for an overnight camping trip. I think the unit is uh, water resistant, at least. It might be waterproof, I'm not sure, but I think it's like, uh, you know, dust, dirt, wind, water resistant, all that crap. Um, but yeah, it's a solid unit. You might want to check it out. It's a little pricey, it's $399, but I think for everything that it integrates, it's worth it as far as the technology goes. So give this one a look, check it out, and let me know what you guys think about it.